Moore, the Human Resources Manager at the Batavia Public Library. And I'm Joanne Zillman, Deputy Director and Youth Services Manager at the Batavia Public Library. And today we're coming to you from the beautiful Library Reading Garden. And while it seems like summer out here today, the holidays are just around the corner. Get a jump start on your holiday shopping. The Next Friends monthly book sale will be held on Saturday, November 12th from 9.15 a.m. to 1 p.m. All of our monthly book sales are held in the Friends space, which is located on the lower level of the library. And if you miss the November 12th sale, the next one is Saturday, December 10th. You'll find some gift quality books and materials at sale prices that will leave you and your bank account filled with holiday cheer. Also on Saturday, November 12th is our children's book swap from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Children may bring up to five books to exchange for a book that's new to you. Swap books must be appropriate for children from infants through middle school. No registration need, needed, just stop by and swap. Did you know that November is Native American History Month? Where we celebrate the cultures and contrib contributions of the indigenous peoples, past and present. Now through Wednesday, November 16th, the Batavia Public Library card holders of all ages can experience Big Library Read. Big Library Read is an international reading program that connects millions of readers around the world with an ebook through their public libraries. Join thousands worldwide who are borrowing Darcy Little's Badger's <laughs> indigenous fantasy novel called A Snake Falls to Earth. If you want to check out Darcy's snake falls to the earth. Check it out on our website and go to the search bar and type in that book title. New Lyceum, it's back in person at the library on November 16th at 7 p.m. A special presentation about the tragic Eastland disaster will take place. Presenter John Boda, whose grandmother and two aunts were aboard the Eastland, will share interesting and personal stories, photos, and facts about this tragedy. Register on the events calendar for this event. Also on the 16th will be two Zoom events. Classroom Kitchen is a virtual cooking class featuring retro baking with Jiffy Mix. Learn how to use Jiffy Mix in inventive ways and also how it was invented. Also, at 7 p.m. on the 16th, mortician and best-selling author Caitlin Doty will discuss reform of Western funeral industry practices with Mark Baser, host and creator of the interview show on Chicago-based PBS station WTTW. Register for both of these Zoom events on the library website, web events calendar. We can't forget about Books Between Bites. Our next be Books Between Bites is Thursday, November 17th at noon. Batavia's Mayor Jeff Schelke will share his latest literary discoveries that mention the city of Batavia during the lost Batavia literature. Registration is not required for this free event. Bring your own lunch or better yet, stop by the Flyleaf Bakery Cafe and grab a sweet or savory treat. November 17th is also Family Reading Night in Illinois. Batavia Library is celebrating this event with fun take-home kits, which include a craft, snacks, activity sheets, and more. Take-home kits for Family Reading Night will be available from Tuesday, November 15th through Thursday, November 17th. No need to register. Kits will be available while supplies last. To really help you get into the Thanksgiving mood, visit the library on Sunday, November 20th for our special Sundays on Stage event, The Pilgrims and the First Thanksgiving. Presenter Nancy McCulley will share stories and the origins of the Thanksgiving traditions and the true story of the Pilgrims during 
this 2 p.m. program. Please register for this event in our events calendar on our website. Hey, have you ever wanted to learn how to knit or crochet or make your own jewelry? Beginning this month, we have a new database of online arts and crafts workshops called Creative Bug. Creative Bug offers thousands of video classes. Log in with your Batavia library card and watch videos on your own time. You too can create arts and craft projects for those homemade holiday gifts. Speaking of the holidays, the library will close at 5 p.m. on Wednesday, November 23rd. And the library will be closed all day, Thursday, November 24th, for the Thanksgiving holiday. And before we go, I just want to mention that we have a couple of job openings, including a full-time facilities assistant and two part-time library assistants. If you would like to come work in a fun and rewarding environment, be sure to go to our website and check out how to apply and more details. Thank you for spending some time with us today. We wish you and your family a wonderful Thanksgiving and hope to see you at the library soon. Until next time, bye. bye.